Roberto Carlos' free kick breaks the laws of physics and breaks the secret that the ball lies 35 meters behind the right side of the goal. Give this free kick to any player and ask him if he scores a goal, he will score a goal. They'll shout you crazy from the table. But in 1997, there was someone who said the opposite of all those players, Roberto Carlos took a free kick against France that broke all the laws of physics. What's special about that free? Carlos kick. Please watch the video. In June 1997, a year before the 1998 World Cup, France launched a four-a-side tournament to lift your spirits. In 1997, this four-man tournament featured four big men. Includes Brazil, host country, France, United Kingdom and Italy. Surely, when we were young, many of us were fascinated by the magical shots of famous players such as Ronaldinho, Ronaldo de Lima and Zidane. It's sad, and certainly not to mention Roberto Carlos's long playing career. A long shot against the French team. Through this tournament, soccer fans will surely remember Roberto Carlos' seemingly impossible free kick. The same goes for the Brazilian defender who has a magic left foot. This is especially true for fans who witnessed shots weighing the errant five ball. It would be crazy to follow a shot from 410 to 450 G. That punishment for Roberto Carlos, even if you erase the images of some stars to insult them, are they crazy about your face? I'm going to say, go ahead and do it. Yes, that would definitely be crazy to ask. The player takes a free kick from a distance of 35 meters from a difficult position with a four-man fence standing in front. If it's strong enough, the air resistance acting on the ball will slow it down. It can be easily destroyed by a goalkeeper, but before Roberto Carlos June shot in 1997 made the laws of physics we all know, such as air resistance and friction, meaningless. January 3, 2019. A match was held between France and Brazil in 1997. As mentioned above, Brazil was awarded a free kick from 35 meters away. It was Roberto who took the free kick after the Frenchman's foul. Carlos. He laid the ball down to gain momentum. A very long distance from the ball, about 10 or 11 meters, Carlos ran forward and hit a miraculous shot with the outside of his foot, but the ball flew straight and tight. Still in the air, it entered the French penalty area. Instead of going in a straight line, the ball suddenly changed its trajectory and flew out of the field, then suddenly stopped, veered to the left, turned down, and flew into the French goal upon impact from the goalkeeper. Fabian Baser explains the solution to the goal scientists at France's Polytechnic University have expanded their research 20 years after the free kick that left every scientist scratching his head. Roberto Carlos told the media he did not know why. Does that free kick score a goal? I have no idea how he scored that goal. After each practice, I practice free kicks in my own style several times. I often use free kicks to practice free kicks. On days when the weather was good, the shot was good. Legendary Brazilian defender Roberto Carlos joined Real Madrid from Inter Milan in 1997 but said truly became a superstar after his stunning strike against the French side later that year. Lost to compatriot Ronaldo in the race for FIFA's top title Roberto Carlos wins next 12 months wins a total of three Champions League titles with the Spanish giant the Brazilian legend is still considered a complete player a model for the world's left backs to look up to, how what do you think? What do you think of Roberto Carlos' free kick and will anyone take that free kick again now? Leave your thoughts in the comments and don't forget. Please leave a like, subscribe and follow channel. Channel hello to support us. See you again in the next video.